Now, welcome to our new class. We have to discuss the chapters. This we have to revise the chapter of chapter number one, that is to be electricity. We have to discuss Joule's law of heating in the previous lectures, and after that, we have to discuss the major aspects, which is to be <coughs> in the circuits. Now, we have to begin one question of the reasons. We have a simple resistor here, and this is our battery. Suppose battery is of 50 volt, resistance of 5 volt. Question is that find current flow, find heat loss. So. Five ohm resistor. Three ohm, five ohm resistor. In time five seconds. This is that. So now we have to see that. There is a five ohm resistor here. If this five ohm resistor, how much current is flowing from the five ohm resistor? And this is negative terminal and this is positive terminal. Current is flowing from the higher terminal to lower terminal, and this is to be. And suppose we have current I is flowing in the loop, then using KVL. In loop, plus twenty this is higher, this is lower. I into R is equal to zero. This is to be four and zero. We have to conclude that the current flowing in the loop is 4 ampere. Now, how much heat is lost through the five volts? This is the connecting wires. And connecting wire has no resistance. Connecting wire has no resistance. If connecting wire has no resistance, then the resistance is approximately is equal to zero. It means from here to here there is no loss of energy and no loss of And from here to here, there is also a no loss of energy. But heat loss in five ohm resistor is heat loss in five ohm resistor is h is equal to i square of e and what is the current resistance and the current is 4 ampere so it's what is the value of resistance i and this is the Five into five, twenty-five into sixteen. This is the part. This is the four hundred joule energy that is to be lost by this process. So we have to simply using the concept. First, we have to use the 
presence of current. What is the current flow in the circuit? We have to identify the current. After that, we have to see that what is the net current in the flow in the circuit. We are using the formula of what is the heat loss in the circuit is H square IT and that is the heat loss I square IT. We have to use the simple I square IT formula. So we have to see here. This is the basic concepts that is to be using here, and this is to be 5 into 5, and 5 into 5 is 25, and this is 25 into 6, 4, 0, and this is 100. That is to be answer in using this. This amount of energy or heat which is to be lost by the circuit and this goes into the heat. This is the concepts we have to used here. This is the first question we have to attempt related to the heat loss and how the heat loss to be destroy the heat, destroy the energy of our circuits. This is 400 energies that is to be lost by the circuits.